in this lesson, we'll create a section view through the main stair of the building. We will then split the section so it also cuts through the building elevator shaft. Also, we will create an elevation view of the south side wing of the building by placing an elevation marker and modifying the extents of the elevation plane. From the menu browser, click Open and open the file RAC AVS 02 Section Elevation. Then click the View tab and from the Create panel click Section. Then draw a vertical section between grid lines 2 and 3, cutting through the stair. You can move the section line after you place it. Then zoom in to the section head and click the Cycle Section Head Control three times to view the section head symbol options. Then zoom to fit and drag the right section control to the left until it is just to the right of the pavilion. This controls the depth of the section to include only what you want to display in the section view. Next, from the section panel, click Split Segment. This tool allows you to break the section line and move a portion of the section so that it passes through the elevator shaft of the building. Zoom in to the lower flight of stairs and click the section line below the lower flight of steps. Then move your cursor down and to the right so that the section line cuts through the elevator shaft and click. Then press escape twice. Then zoom to fit and we will now modify element visibility in the view. Zoom into the section head and double click the section head to open the view. Select the crop region boundary and adjust the boundaries by dragging the controls. Then on the view control bar click hide crop region. Next in the project browser expand sections right click section 1 and click rename. In the rename view dialog type section through main stair and click OK. Next we'll create an elevation view. In the project browser under Floor Plans, double click 01 Entry Level. Then right click in the drawing area and select Zoom to Fit. And from the View tabs Create panel, click the Elevation drop down and select Elevation. Then in the Type Selector, make sure that Building Elevation is selected. Then zoom into the longer wing of the building and place the marker pointing south above the longer wing of the building. Then click Modify. Then select the arrow portion of the elevation marker. Then zoom out so you can see the entire wing and adjust the extents and position of the elevation plane. Next, in the Project Browser, under Elevations, Right click Elevation 1A and click Rename. Then type Courtyard Elevation South Wing and click OK. Then double click the new name to open the view. Then on the view control bar click Hide Crop Region. Then close the file as that concludes this lesson.